Hey hello guys it's How to Tech Simplified back again with another easy tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to add a digital product such as a ebook or a guide to a physical product on your Shopify store. So let's say they buy the physical product and they automatically receive the guide or the ebook for free. Now let's get straight into it. The first thing that you want to do is open up your preferred browser, head down to Shopify and sign into your store. Now from here, we're first going to create the digital product. And after that, we're going to create the physical product and we're going to combine them. Now the first step that you want to take is go down to the applications, go to the digital download applications, search it in the search bar right here, install it to your page, and then you come up with this application. Now the first step that you want to do is install this and go down to products. Now once the digital download application has been installed, you can add a product right here. Now for the digital product, we're going to type it digital product we're going to create a guide so it's the guide for the physical product now give it a random a picture or a picture that you like now if you price it uh, it will automatically be free when it gets added to the cart so you can create value without there being value so price it at 10 for example we don't need to track the quantity because it's a digital product and this is the most important part uncheck the physical product part right here because this automatically creates the digital product for us simply press save and now we're saving the product the product has been created but there's not a file in the location yet so what we're going to do we're going to applications we're going to digital downloads and inside digital downloads you see the file just has been created as of here the digital product now here we can add the digital product right here now what this will do it will add a file so for instance add the ebook or the guide simply open it up press save and now it should be saved and the digital file so the ebook or the guide is ready to use. Now we're going to the products once again to create the physical product and a product. So let's say um, this should be the main product that the buyer will buy. So simply type physical product. And here you can add in this description, we'll send you a guide to download and here you can add a media um, at a price one two three cost per item and add the shipping and this should be a normal product now simply press save now from here we created a physical product we created a digital product and now we're going to combine the both now we're going to do that in the discount tabs in the discount tabs we're going to create a discount right here and we're going to select the buy X get Y, the product discount. Now the X is the physical product and the Y is the digital product. And we're going to set this to automatically discount. Now this will automatically send the user the digital guide or the ebook and when they buy the physical product. So here, get the guide. And here you have the customer buys, the customer gets. Now the customer buys one item of the specific product. That is the product we're going to browse right here. And that's the physical product that we've just created right here. Simply add it to the customer buys. And now the customer gets one product of the guide, as you can see right here or right here that we've just created simply check this add it and here press free or amount of which is 10 so they actually see that it was 10 euros before and now they get a discount of the 10 euros now the availability uh, this discount is automatically applies after sales should 
press on available and here you can combine it with product discounts with order discount with shipping discount because this is a purchase that will always be there now here you have the active date and you can set the end date now simply save the discount and now it's all ready to be used now make sure to test this on your own store beforehand so simply buy the product that you just created so you can see that it actually uh, sends you the digital download for you and you can actually use the guide now if you still get any other questions regarding this useful tutorial or if this tutorial has helped you please leave a like and subscribe this helps me out a lot and thank you for watching